I know Frizz. Uh, Frizz is a very strong Kansas player. One of the top five Falcons in Project M. Uh, not quite as dominant in Smash 4, but uh, he's definitely not a slouch. I mean, he, he destroyed me in Smash 4. Alright, so it's Frizz versus Z. Frizz is going to get off to a very aggressive start. Uh, getting those tilt combos. Uh, Sheik is a very strong character in, in Smash 4. Very hard to deal with um, if you if you don't know how. It's a, some characters you can kind of you can kind of feel your way through and figure out. Sheik is one of those characters that if you don't know how to deal with her, it's going to be a very hard process for you to deal with. Like that's just that's just the cold hard truth about it. Hey everybody, silent protagonist on the mic here. Going to join you for some commentary. We got uh, losers round two: Frizz versus Z. All right, we see uh, Frizz kind of keeping things uh, very even. Hmm. I feel like uh, Olimar is playing too much of like a uh, an aggressive game. He needs to be a little bit more passive. Yeah, he needs to be more passive. Like I want to see him. Uh, like I want to see him kind of wall out Frizz a little bit more. Yeah. All right. So. Oh wow. Uh, I think that was Pikmin throw. Yep. Takes the uh, first stock pretty handedly. All right. We'll see what Bobby's got. All right, gets back on stage. Ooh, he's kind of just throwing those big ones off. Maybe he's trying to get into that cycle. Uh, oh, yeah, he pulled yep. out a, a purple one there. Pulled himself out the, in the purple Pikmin. <clears throat> oh, no, that was a very smart recovery because uh, whenever Olimar has a lot of Pikmin out, his up B goes a lot slower, so he threw the purple one on oh, the stage yeah, yeah. to lighten himself up a little bit. Oh, good forward air there. Sends yeah. him off stage. Frizz did a very good job of, of just keeping Z out, like not letting Z get comfortable here. Yeah. He's going to have to intercept that recovery. I'm thinking probably with the bouncing fish, though, because Sheik has a lot of trouble killing unless you just go deep. Yeah, that, uh, I mean, that's that's the thing he's just going to have to do here. Oh, he's going to get the forward smash. He's going to even it up. Good stuff. Okay, getting something going here. How to get oh, out of likewise. it? Get some throws. Oh, tilts the wrong way, though. Eats a down smash for it. Okay, this is good what Olimar's doing. Ooh, this is where he shines. He's got to stay away from uh, Sheik. He's got to try to stay away from This is how the matchup's going to be kind of awkward. Awkward, because Olimar wants to run away. He wants to throw his Pikmin at you. He doesn't want to do anything to you up close because he has kind of a weak game. But Sheik just wants to get in on you, and that's probably why uh, Bobby plays this character, honestly. Yeah, Bobby has always had uh, a more aggressive play style. I mean, you can tell that by the characters you know he chooses to play. What Z's got to do here is like he's really just kind of keep. I mean, like you say, he's got to keep Bobby out. He's got to wall him out, and I mean that forward throw is going to be going to be good for the uh, good for the the game win there. Yep, and Z takes the first game. I wonder what the counter pick will be. I'm probably going to assume he 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 might run that back. Actually, it's a pretty good neutral stage. Um, he doesn't really know much about this game. But, uh, you know, he's putting in the work right now. Oh, no, he actually opts to go to uh, Battlefield. I'm not sure I like this counter pick because it's going to give uh, Olimar a more of a chance to just kind of like run away and keep his zoning game uh, more intact, perhaps. Yeah, but at the same time, it also gives Bobby more more approach options. He has more platforms to play with, you know, more platforms to to use to avoid the the Pikmin here. It's just really it's really going to come down to like who can utilize the the new uh, platforms in this matchup uh, better. Yeah. All right, doesn't quite get that forward smash. Going to eat a lot of forward tilts because of it. Couldn't quite get the combo going there with the forward airs. Gets back on stage nonetheless and shakes that Pikmin that was attached to him. Good stuff. Uh, Z doing a uh, Z doing a very good job of, of keeping Bobby out at the moment. Uh, I was gonna find a, find a hit confirm in there and go go with it, but uh, yeah, Frizz definitely being the melee player he is, he's just gonna go out there and he's gonna he's gonna throw a bouncing fish at you. So Olimar uh, Z, he's gonna have to just really kind of be cognizant of that and uh, recover very smartly. Otherwise, he's gonna eat that and uh, take a stock for it. A strong right. back air. Let's see what. See if Bobby can make anything happen with it. Ooh. Oh, I almost feel like he tried to do something with the wind box there. Yeah, it's, it's some wind box. Like, I think he tried to use the like the edge casting of the the uppy there a little bit. Uh, oh no, Ooh, that's not how you want to. Yeah, that's not how you want to fight all of our man. Just eats all those Pikmin that he threw at him. Percentage is tacking on really quickly, and Bobby. he just gets that finishing move. 
Bob is having a hard time getting hit confirms with those tilts, and I mean, you can tell it's... Oh, no. Oh. And that is definitely something you do not want to do as a uh, Sheik main. Um, Ryan can probably tell you the same thing. Um, do a grenade as you're going off the stage, you're going oh. to eat your stock for it. You're going to have a bad time. Yep.